Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is so nice to have you here. Welcome. I hope you all are having an amazing day. In today's video, I really wanted to share with you guys a review as well as a tutorial or like a sort of a wash and go using a couple of products from Mayel. And specifically, I am going to be using a couple of products from the line Rosemary and Mint. I have a full playlist here on my channel all about about a one brand wash and go as well as curly hair products review if you are interested definitely check out my description box so of course starting with the first product which is the rosemary mint strengthening shampoo i apply a generous amount of the shampoo in my soaking soaking wet hair which for me is definitely important because i do have low porosity hair and as you can see the shampoo subs suds up quite nicely too the shampoo is sulfate free but i do feel like it gives my hair a deep clean without actually stripping it. I also really really like the mintiness of the shampoo. It definitely feels very refreshing and cooling on my hair as well as on my scalp. Moving on to the hair mask, I also apply a generous amount of the mask in my hair. I focus it on my ends first, and then I like to sort of like massage it everywhere and I even get it on my scalp, which actually feels really, really nice. I'm not gonna lie. I also detangle with the mask a little bit, but I don't think that it has enough slip to really get the tough knots out of your hair. So definitely be gentle if you want to detangle with this hair mask. I usually leave it in my hair for a couple of minutes as I finish the rest of my shower and then I will rinse out the hair mask. It is a particularly sunny day here in the Netherlands and the lighting is going to go in and out. But right from the bat, I do have to say though, I absolutely love these two products. I am giving them a huge, huge, huge thumbs up. They are giving everything that they are supposed to give and I'm obsessed with it. Moving on to the styling portion of this video. The styling product that the line has is actually the Mayel Rosemary Mint Multivitamin Daily Styling Creme or cream. I think it's a creme. It is infused with biotin and it encourages hair growth. As it states here on the bottle, section hair and apply product to damp or dry hair. Personally, I am going to use it on a damp to slightly wet hair because that just gives me the best results. And it also states here, do not rinse, style as a desire. For best results, use as a daily styling cream for twist outs, braid outs, and wash and go styles. And today I am going to use it as a for a wash and go. So as you guys already know, I like to apply products in my hair in sections and this is usually my very first section that I work with this a bottom section and like I said I do want to apply this to wet to damp hair so I'm gonna re-wet it a little bit with my continuous mister this is a spray bottle that I absolutely love that I recommend to everyone the just the continuous mister is just it's superior than the regular spray bottles i'm not gonna lie going in with my styling creme as you can see the product is a very it's not thick but it's not like it's not too thick but it's not like too watery either this is like a regular cream and in terms of the scent it smells just like the shampoo and the conditioner which is a very minty scent and it feels refreshing but it smells refreshing as well so as you can see, I am applying the styling cream to my section right here, my next section. And I do have to agree though, my hair feels better if I apply the product to it when it's damp. If my hair is soaking wet, it kind of, it kind of feels like the product is sliding off my hair. And on a somewhat damp hair, it actually feels like my hair is, is absorbing the product. And honestly, it is feeling pretty good so far. It feels a little bit different because normally I like to go in with a um, leave-in conditioner first and then a cream of some sort, but this is going to be a one product wash and go. And I am very curious to see how this is, this wash and go is going to turn out. Alrighty guys, so it is a couple of hours later and I cannot believe that I'm even filming this part because this is pretty shocking. But my hair is 100% dry and this took me 
three hours, I think, completely air dried my hair. And normally, I'm, I'm pretty shocked about that because normally it takes me around five to six hours to completely air dry my hair, sometimes even seven hours. So I'm pretty shocked. But honestly, I shouldn't be too shocked because one, I did not apply this product on soaking wet hair. And two, I only used one product. The thing that I'm most impressed by right now is that I have an insane amount of gel cast. My hair is so incredible incredibly incredibly crunchy that i'm just like wow, how is this even possible you know what i mean since my hair is 100% dry, I am going to use the next product that I have in the Rosemary and Mint collection, which is the Rosemary and Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil. This oil is infused with biotin. It encourages hair growth as well. And it is for daily use, scalp treatment, and split end care. I don't necessarily agree with the last part, the split end care, because if you have split ends, you just have to cut them off one product specifically one little oil is not going to magically erase your split end so i don't agree with that but you guys know if you watch my videos on a regular basis you know that i absolutely love this oil this is my second bottle actually and it has been a part of my curly hair care routine since last year around april and may so one year one year and a couple of months and i am going to scoop this much of the oil is it a scoop, pump, suck, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to try to get this oil pretty much everywhere. And then I'm going to take a couple of seconds to just massage the oil in my hair and kind of make sure that I can distribute it everywhere. So it is the next morning and I have a couple of stuff that I want to say actually I don't I'm not happy with my hair I'm not happy with my results at all like I said I used the styling cream yesterday and this is the only product that I have in my hair and I also said that I have that I had an insane amount of gel cast and I did everything in my power to get rid of the gel cast I used the sweet almond oil I used another oil the African pride oil I'll pop it up on the screen to really do my best to get rid of the gel cast and when I went to bed last night i was like you know what it's probably just me i will wake up tomorrow morning and the gel cast will pretty much be gone and unfortunately that was not the case i still have it is the next morning and i still have an insane amount of gel cast an insane amount that it actually feels uncomfortable on my scalp if i play with my hair a little bit i can actually feel and hear the, the my hair sort of like ripping from my scalp and it is not a pleasant feeling at all and as you can see, I just put my hair in this low ponytail and I, I think they, these couple of curls, they frame my face quite nicely. I like it. Anyway, now on to my final thoughts on these products, starting with the shampoo and the hair mask. Like I said multiple times now in this video, I give these two products a huge, huge, huge thumbs up. What I like about them the most is the, the mintiness and the cooling and the refreshing effect of them, but I do think that they are not overpowering at all. So a big fat thumbs up. Now on to the next two products, starting with the styling cream. For me, this is a big fail for a wash and go. As you can see, I'm not happy with my results at all, but I do love it for my hairstyles here on my channel. This is for me, a sort of like a two in one. It's a leave-in conditioner and a gel, and that just saves time. So I like it as a styler to do hairstyles on my hair, not in wash and goes. At all. And then I have the Mayel Rosemary Bin Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil. And if you have seen a couple of my videos, you guys know that I absolutely love this little guy right here. This is my second bottle and I definitely need to buy another bottle. One other thing I do have to say about this scalp oil though is that I don't believe that this is the reason why my hair grew so much because I, if you're new here on my channel, I'm actively trying to grow my big chop. I don't think I can call my hair my big chop here anymore more now i just have curly hair and short curly hair if you will um this is not the reason why my hair grew i don't think it works like that hair growth is much 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 bigger than just one oil you know what i mean but i really do like to incorporate this in my morning routine it's just sort of like a, my way to 
give that extra 30 seconds to myself you know what i mean it feels nice to just kind of like massage my scalp for a little bit and just have uh, that moment of self-care for me that's why i love this product so much and i definitely do think that it contributes to the health of my scalp overall i hope that you guys have enjoyed today's video if you did definitely do let me know by giving this video a big fat thumbs up if you have any experience using these products definitely do let me know in the comment section and down below and i will hopefully see you guys again in my next video bye